Wait, what? Are we being checked? Oh, shit. We're being attacked. This is not what I wanted. I just wanted a good sleep in this garage, okay? Not be overrun by, I don't know, something bad, that's for sure. Okay, okay. Calm down, Flynn. Calm down, Flynn. I'm just gonna need to get out of this room. Then I can figure something out. Well, never mind. I have to stay in this room. The bun demands it all. Oh god, I'm gonna die here, am I? Okay, maybe I can do these three adequate options. I can stay here and check these boxes, but I'm pretty sure there's no food in there. Or I can rewire this bun to open this door, but I never learned how to rewire anything. Or I can shoot it, but every sane person knows for a fact that shooting a bun won't exactly help, and I might screw myself permanently out of hell with it. Wow, that actually worked. Does this gun have nano machines? In which. Oh god. Oh my god. I'm starting to feel queasy. Ugh. Yeah, this is definitely not tomato sauce. Nor is it red paint. Ugh. Well, I'm gonna take these mags anyway. I don't have a rifle, but I could sell it to a gun store if I get off this planet, that's for sure. And man, being ripped to shreds must suck. Oh well. Rest in peace, whoever you guys are. Huh, anything interesting here? Mm, probably nothing. Maybe candy and treasure. Ah yes, more dead bodies. Surely this will lead me to a better place. No wait, it won't. Ugh. Thank God I'm wearing a helmet. But looking at these dead bodies are just. Ugh. And I certainly need a red key card. Well, I don't have one. I'll well just get going with my depressing thing. And I can check this tower, but I've already seen enough destruction. Speaking of which, what the hell is this? This looks like something you see out of Evil Dead 2. Or even Salem, I don't know. I mean, they have spikes on their knees and shoulders. Even on their nipples. But what am I doing? Why am I questioning about this? I'm pretty sure these are the unknown enemies that killed these marines. And died? Yeah. Oh, there's a door right there. I hope it doesn't require you to have a key or something. Which I don't understand why. Yeah, I'm good. Although it does make sense in this kind of situation. We're being overrun by aliens or mutants. Mm, bit too sturdy. I can't break these. And having them on Earth might be a bad idea. No, wait. An ultimate bad idea. Alright, is there? Yeah, I knew that. There is a spaceship, but it looks fucked up. In all seriousness, I'm definitely screwed. I mean, I can break these windows and explore the barren wastelands of Mars, but I'll be exploring the barren wastelands of Mars. And besides, I don't have food or even a drink. Ugh. All right, let's see. Is that? Hey, is that a red key card? Oh yeah, it is. Now I can open that red door. Now let's go down. Okay. Ugh. You know, I want to know why that red key is on top of that box. Whoever put it there, I gotta commend them. It makes my life a lot easier. But things haven't gone to shit yet, so I'm good with that. I just realized I forgot to check on that door, but I want to check out the red one first. There might be some supplies and... Oh wait, I just remembered something. Nano machines. Yeah! There is no way in hell that a normal bullet can actually affect the button. I mean, surely the button must have given off electric current to that bullet, and somehow it opened the door? Well, I call bullshit. Like, how did this door open? It has to be nano machines. They're probably wandering around by now. Which I don't have a problem with that. I have plenty in my pocket, and there's nothing here. So, to the red door. Now, I hope there's a survivor in there. He might help me on my journey. Ah, well, so much for having a survivor. Which is sad, I kind of want to talk to someone. And I'll take this key, and it'll totally help me on my way. As for the Marines, well, I believe they had a good life, and they should have gone out with a bang. Like, that would probably make the families a bit proud. Ugh. Well, this is a big problem. I got living, breathing things to worry about. They don't have ears. Then again, octo spiders are deaf too, and they are highly intelligent species. And I do not want to mess with these guys. They're probably gonna rip me apart. Okay, they don't know us. All right. Okay, never mind. They're not okay. They're not okay. Okay, okay, okay. Whoa, is that fireball? Is that fireball? Oh jeez. Holy crap! Was that? Yeah, it was. Those things are sorcerers. I I'm out of here. They can just die. Oh, for God's sake, this door's broken too? 
Ah, oh, god damn it. There must be something at the back. Oh, don't kill me! Oh, good, they weren't there. Oh. Yeah, I did need a key. Thank Christ I grabbed it. Or else I have to fight those wretched dark wizards. Which, I'm pretty sure they're not, but they did throw a fireball at me, so yeah. Hey, there's a switch. Hope it works. Then again, I have nano machines. They can help me. Oh, yup. Huh, what it open? Oh my god, yes, the elevator doors! Okay, we gotta sneak there. Sneak, sneak. Alright, got the saw snake. And don't get caught by those monsters! Which is never a good thing. I do not want to fight, and I'm not up to fighting this now. And they have fireballs! Yeah. Oh well. I am just getting out of here. No ifs or buts. And if I do find a straggler, I hope he's a good fighter. If he's not, then he better have food. Maybe he has Twix or Hershey's, or just anything I can eat. And I'm also getting a bad feeling for some reason. 